starting a brand new market. Well, the language barrier never makes a difference because there's something called Google Translate, okay? Starting a new market, I never ever go into a market if I don't have someone there. I don't go to grow, I go where it's growing. I'm gonna repeat that, I don't go to grow, I go where it's growing. My job is to add gas and fuel on the fire to help it explode. So I'm out here in Brazil right now, okay? And I wanna let you know that, you know, when you get into each market, you go on Instagram and you reach out to random people and maybe they respond, maybe they don't respond. They respond to me because they see my profile. They see the amount of followers, the amount of likes I get, the amount of engagement. And what happened before I had all that engagement, before I had all that success? Well, I worked my butt off so people could follow me, people could like my stuff. I could build a brand. Most people think the brand comes first, then the work. No, the work comes first, the inspiration is next, and then people will follow you, and that's where the brand is created. So when you come into a market, always make sure you are people. Make a list of people, reach out to people on social media, Instagram, Facebook, okay? If you have those followers, and they're not making you money, they're not really followers. They're not following you anywhere. I'm all about helping my people make money, and yes, they make me a little bit of money, and who cares about how much they make me? I wanna help them win big. I wanna create a legacy in each country I go to. So right now as we speak, I'm on a tour around the world. And I'm touring, and I gotta meet people every day. Influencers, celebrities, you know, actors, whatever, normal people, network marketers. I wanna just engage, build my network up. Me, people, we don't have to just sign people up all the time. We want to build relationships with people. We want to get to know people. So you can walk anywhere in the world and ask one question, one phrase, and you will win 100 out of 100 times. Do you keep your income options open? In other words, are you open to the idea of making more money over and above what you're currently making? No one said no to that question. I've never heard someone say no. Get them to take their phone out, add you on Instagram or Facebook. Let's keep the contact. And then invite them to a presentation, show them the information, build a relationship with them, enroll them and take action. But I always come to a market where it's growing because I've wasted a lot of money going to markets trying to grow. I've lost a lot of money. People join, people quit. There was no real leader. So with Zoom and Skype and Ubu and all these platforms, you can work with them online and then move offline. Online, offline, face to face, one on one, two on one, home events. So I hope that helps you build a dynasty because it is helping me do one right now. I'm in Rio de Janeiro and I don't really speak Portuguese but I'm learning, I'm making the effort. Google Translate is helping me right now. Use it or abuse it.